Milwaukee visiting Pittsburgh, pitching Giovanni Gallardo just off the DL with an oblique injury, causing him to miss the All-Star game. Bottom one, and off back-to-back -back two home run games, rookie Pedro Alvarez strikes out against Gallardo. Bottom two, and Gallardo gets the opposing pitcher Ross Ohlendorf on strikes. On the mound, Ohlendorf with just one wing coming in, hoping to change those fortunes. Top three, and he strikes out Ricky Weeks, then the righty also fanning Ryan Braun to end the inning. Top four still scoreless, but Prince Fielder quickly changes that, leading off the inning. Fielder hits that one high in the air. Did he get enough? You better believe it. That is way gone. Fielder with another home run. Bottom six, and Eric Kratz skying one to the gap. Jim Edmonds over, making a nice grab, ending the inning, and that finishing Gallardo's night. Six shutout innings, allowing five hits and fanning five. Top seven now, one on, Evan Meek pitching, and so it's Meek against Weeks, and Ricky wins this battle. Well hit right center, that ball's got a charge to it, and it is back, and it is gone! A home run for Ricky Weeks. Bottom seven, two outs, Todd Coffey facing runners at the corners, and rookie Neil Walker at the plate, and Walker delivers this, liner down the right field line. One run will score. Delwyn Young will be coming to the plate. The throw is coming in. Young chugging in and sliding home safely. Two-run double for Walker. The Pirates to within 3-2. And after starting and beating Pittsburgh on Monday, Chris Capuano in to relieve now, but Garrett Jones with the comebacker, that ending the inning, and the Brewers clinging to that 3-2 lead. We go bottom nine, and John Axford fanning Jose Tabata to end it. The Brewers hanging on in this one, winning 3-2. So, these teams splitting this four-game series. Gallardo did not allow a runner past second base. He's now won nine of his last 11 decisions.